Welcome to London, a city that enthralls with its rich history and vibrant energy. This is a city where ancient and modern intertwine to create a tapestry of experiences that are as diverse as they are unforgettable. From the timeless treasures of the British Museum to the modern marvel that is the London Eye, from the historic fortress of the Tower of London to the lush green expanses of Hyde Park, every corner of this city has a story to tell. Add to this the unmissable changing of the guard at Buckingham Palace, the shopping paradise of Harrods, the artistic haven of the National Gallery, and the iconic Tower Bridge and Houses of Parliament with Big Ben standing tall, and you have a city that never ceases to amaze. Without further ado, let's dive right into the heart of this amazing city. Our first stop is the British Museum, a treasure trove of world art and artifacts. This venerable institution established in the mid-18th century, houses an impressive collection that spans over two million years of history. From ancient civilizations to modern times the museum is a testament to the ingenuity and creativity of humankind. One of its most famous exhibits is the Rosetta Stone, a crucial key to deciphering Egyptian hieroglyphs. This artifact, discovered in 1799, unlocked the secrets of an ancient civilization and opened up a new understanding of human history. Another highlight is the Parthenon sculptures, also known as the Elgin Marbles. These masterpieces from ancient Greece are a testament to the artistic prowess of the Athenians in the 5th century BC. They are a sight to behold, capturing the essence of human form and emotion in marble. A visit to the British Museum is like taking a journey through history. Next we head to the Tower of London, a historic fortress that has served many purposes over the centuries. This imposing structure nestled on the banks of the River Thames has played a central role in English history for nearly a thousand years. Originally built by William the Conqueror in the 11th century, the tower has been a royal palace, a treasury, and even a menagerie. But it's perhaps most famous as a prison, housing some of the most notable figures in English history, from Anne Boleyn to Guy Fawkes. As we delve deeper into the tower's stone-clad walls, we encounter the radiant glimmer of the crown jewels. These symbols of royal authority are not only priceless, but they also hold centuries of stories. From the grand coronations to the intricate tales of power and prestige, the Tower of London is a testament to the city's rich and varied past. Now, let's take to the skies on the London Eye, a giant Ferris wheel with breathtaking views. As we ascend into the heavens, the hustle and bustle of the city fades into a serene panorama. The London Eye, standing tall on the south bank of the River Thames, offers a unique perspective of the city. As we rise higher, iconic landmarks unfold before our eyes, the Houses of Parliament, Big Ben, and the sprawling Hyde Park among others. During this 30-minute journey, the city's skyline stretches out, unveiling a stunning tapestry of history and modernity. From this towering vantage point, we can see as far as 40 kilometers on a clear day. As the wheel slowly turns, the city gently moves with it, creating a mesmerizing spectacle of London's grandeur. And as we descend, the memory of the city's skyline etched in our minds, we realize that this isn't just a ride, but an experience. A ride on the London Eye is truly a high point of any trip to London. After the excitement of the London Eye, it's time to relax with a leisurely stroll through Hyde Park. This grand park, one of the largest in London, offers a delightful respite from the city's hustle and bustle. Imagine yourself spreading a picnic blanket on the lush green lawns, sharing laughter and sandwiches with loved ones under a clear blue sky. Or perhaps you fancy a serene boat ride across the Serpentine, the park's large recreational lake, as swans gracefully float by. Hyde Park is also home to several remarkable monuments and a vibrant venue for concerts and events. And if you're a fan of horse riding, the park offers bridle paths for an unforgettable equestrian experience. But sometimes the simplest pleasures are the best. Just strolling through the park, soaking in the tranquil beauty, and watching the world go by can be a treat in itself. Hyde Park is a beautiful oasis in the heart of the bustling city. For our next adventure we head to the West End Theatre District, home to world-class performances. This vibrant neighborhood is a hub of creativity and drama, where you can find a plethora of theatres, each with their own distinct charm and history. From the ornate grandeur of the Theatre Royal Drury Lane, the oldest London theatre still in use, to the contemporary Savoy Theatre, the first public building in the world to be lit entirely by electricity. The West End has been the birthplace of many iconic shows such as Les Miserables, The Phantom of the Opera, and Mamma Mia. But it's not just musicals that take center stage here. The West End also showcases a wide array of plays, ballets and operas, 
offering something for every kind of theater enthusiast. A night at the theater is an essential part of any London experience. Now let's head to Buckingham Palace for the traditional changing of the guard ceremony. This spectacle is a time-honored tradition that showcases the precision and pomp of the Queen's Guard. As they march to the rhythm of a military band, their scarlet tunics and towering bearskin hats are a sight to behold. The ceremony represents the moment when the soldiers currently on duty, the Old Guard, hand over the responsibility of protecting Buckingham Palace and St. James's Palace to the new guard. This exchange is not just a simple shift change, but a ceremonious affair involving a formal parade and musical performance. Witnessing the changing of the guard gives spectators a fascinating insight into the precision and discipline of the British Army. It's an experience steeped in tradition and pageantry, reflecting the grandeur of the monarchy and the duty of the Queen's Guard. The changing of the guard is a fascinating glimpse into royal tradition. Next, we head to Harrods, a world-famous department store that epitomizes luxury shopping. Situated in the heart of Knightsbridge, Harrods is a symbol of opulence and grandeur. With seven floors and 330 departments dedicated to the finest products in food, fashion, homeware and technology, it's a shopping haven for those with a taste for the finer things in life. You'll find a plethora of high-end brands here, from Chanel and Gucci to Louis Vuitton and Prada. Whether you're looking for the latest fashion trends, exquisite jewelry or even a gourmet meal, Harrods caters to your every whim and desire. But it's not just about shopping, Harrods is a destination in itself with its stunning architecture, lavish interiors and renowned food halls that offer an array of gastronomic delights. Shopping at Harrods is an experience in luxury that shouldn't be missed. Our penultimate stop is the National Gallery, home to an impressive collection of over 2,300 paintings. This internationally renowned institution plays host to countless masterpieces, representing the pinnacle of artistic achievement from the 13th to the 20th centuries. Imagine losing yourself in the rich hues of Van Gogh's sunflowers, or studying the intricate details of da Vinci's The Virgin of the Rocks. Perhaps you fancy a journey through the romantic landscapes of Turner, or the captivating portraits by Rembrandt. And let's not forget Botticelli's Venus and Mars, a striking display of mythological storytelling on canvas. The National Gallery is not just an art museum, it's a journey through time, a glimpse into the minds of artistic geniuses, and a testament to the transformative power of art. Whether you're an art aficionado or a curious observer, there's something here for everyone. The National Gallery is a must-visit for art enthusiasts and novices alike. Last but not least, we walk across the iconic Tower Bridge and visit the Houses of Parliament and Big Ben. Tower Bridge, with its distinctive twin towers, is more than a century old and a true marvel of Victorian engineering. It's a pedestrian-friendly bridge, allowing us to savor panoramic views of the city from its high-level walkways. Next we move on to the Houses of Parliament, the beating heart of the UK's political life. This magnificent Gothic revival structure houses the House of Commons and the House of Lords. It's a place where history is made, where debates are held and laws are passed. And then we have Big Ben the iconic clock tower standing tall beside the Houses of Parliament. Named after the Great Bell inside, Big Ben is a symbol of London, its chimes familiar to people around the world. These iconic landmarks are the perfect end to our tour of London's top 10 must-haves.